welcome back to my channel. I hope you are well. Today I thought I would do a review of the Inica Baked Mineral Foundation just because a couple of you have been asking about it and they very kindly sent it to me to give it a whirl. So I thought I would try it on and do a little chat about it and then you can see what I think. So don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you enjoyed it because it would absolutely make my day. And let's get into the video. So Inika started in 2006 when um, I think basically they just wanted to try and detox and help consumers who wanted to get more green with their products and especially makeup. So they created the Inika Organics brand. They have amazing ingredients in the products and I really love them, but they're also really high performing. The ingredients are really great. The color payoff is really amazing on the eyeshadows. And overall, I just think they're a really great brand. So um, when they sent this to me, I thought maybe I could do a little review for you because I don't have any powder on at the moment. So I thought you could see. So let's give it a whirl. So this is the Baked Mineral Foundation and this is in the colour Strength. Now, I think it's a little bit light for me at the moment, which is my fault because I chose it. Um, but I think in winter this will be perfect, but just I've got a little bit of colour on my face from the weekend, so it might be a tad bit light. But I normally think that's okay. If you want to then warm, up, warm something up, if you want to use a powder foundation, then that's great. You can just use a bronzer. Um, I'm using this on top of my makeup to set it um, just because for me powder foundations don't give that much coverage um, but from when I've tried this it really really does but I prefer it on top of a cream foundation. Now if you've got oilier skin then you might want to use this as um, just your normal foundation which is great but for me it's just a topper. So they also sent me this really cute little brush which I really rate, it's really cool. So. I'm just gonna pop some on. Now, as you can see, it's a little bit light for my skin, but the coverage on it is really actually amazing. And I like how it doesn't feel cakey. It's non-cakey makeup, which is just incredible. So, I feel like a knicker is a non-cakey, non-toxic makeup brand, so it's just awesome. Now, I'm just putting it in my T-zone just because I like to keep the glow around here. I like it going underneath my eyes because like, they're just so deep and dark. They need like a lot of makeup in there just to fill them out a bit. <laughs> oh, so the coverage on this is really, really good. Um, I've got the Jane Iredale BB Cream underneath and that's my foundation that I'm using. And then I'm popping the Inica Baked Mineral Foundation on top, as I just mentioned. And I just really, really love it. There's a spot there, so let's see. We can try and get that away with the foundation. So it's definitely taken the redness off that a lot more. And then I've got some down my neck as well. For some reason, hormones are playing up. And all my spots are everywhere. Now I'm just gonna go and warm this up a little bit again. So I'm just gonna warm the color up again with the Lily Lolo Sculpt and Glow Contour Dupe Palette. Just to go in again a little bit more because I did say that the color was a little bit light on me. Now, they've got eight different shades in it and, and it's matched to their Inica Certified Organic Liquid Foundation and this also has hyaluronic acid in it. So I think it's really great. Um, this isn't sponsored, it's just I wanted to talk about it because it's a fairly new product out and I thought you might like to know before you wanted to buy it. So that was just a really, really quick review um, and just tried it on quickly. I really rate it, actually, I really, really do rate it. Um, it's got the coverage of a loose mineral powder foundation but it's got the convenience of something that's baked and it's pressed and you don't have to worry about it going everywhere in your bag, which is, I do have an issue with that because it, all the powders that I have in my bag go everywhere when they're loose. So this is just really handy. And I also really like the mirror, which, let me put it this way. Oh, hello. 
Okay, I'm being really sad. Oh uh, yeah, the mirror is really good. It's really handy. As you can see, I've used it in a couple of my makeup tutorials before just to do some close up makeup. So um, they've thought about that, about that quite well. And um, just the packaging's really nice and it's quite soft. With that in mind, um, Inika very kindly sent me some extra products, which isn't the powder foundation, but what they sent me um, to do as a giveaway for you guys is the Inika Smoky Eye Set, which is this. So in here, you've got the Pressed Mineral Eyeshadow Duo, which is Platinum Steel. And this has such amazing color payoff. It's a really, really awesome color. There's a really, really deep blue and a kind of lighter one, so it's quite fun colors. And then also the Certified Organic Eye Pencil in Black Caviar. If you would like to be in with a chance to win this, then all you need to do is leave a comment below saying, how many different color ranges of baked mineral eyeshadows there are and also tag two friends and get them to follow me and make sure you're following me too and then you'll be in with a chance to win the winner will be announced next week i'll leave all the details below for you so the very very best of luck i really hope you win it and um, it's open worldwide so yeah so i really hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and a subscribe because it would absolutely make my day and i will see you again on the next video hi everyone and welcome back to my channel i hope you are well today i have a very exciting review for you plus plus a giveaway so make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe and stay tuned and watch the whole video because at the end is when I tell you all the details of the giveaway so yeah let's get into the video